What's up gamers? Gamer Dad here. This is a guide to help you complete the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Cowabunga Quest Crack Opponents Shields. If you haven't subscribed, please hit that button and show me that support and don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad, all one word, all capital letters. I greatly appreciate your support. So for this challenge, you simply need to crack opponents shields 10 times. So note, you this includes opponents, which is players, guards, and bosses, and cracking the shield. So when somebody has full shields and you shoot them and the shields go down, that means cracking their shields. So really it's taking a shot on somebody that has full shields. If you, if somebody drops and you take a shot at them and they don't even have shield and you just shoot them, then that does not count. They have to have shields. You can also use the EMP breaker. That does uh, is a shield cracker per se. Um, but I don't actually use that personally myself, and I think it's much easier just to be taking shots at people. So you'll see that as I hit, these are the opponents. So these are the opponents that are, there's a guard and a couple, there's two guards I should say, and a boss at the forecast towers. So this is actually one really good place to do this, and you should be able to crack all three of these people's shields. Just note too as well that if you actually are in a long fight with somebody, if you hit them, then they heal up and get their shields back to 100, you can actually crack them again, which is what happens here. So in this opponent, I'm at four of 10, I crack them, I'd run away just to heal up, I come back, come back out and they've clearly just put their shields back because as I hit them again, I once again crack. So I got two cracks on one single player. As long as they replenish their shields, that is possible. In this case, I'm about to die there, but I did get my six of 10 shield crack. Fast forward a bit, I'm over here at Hazy Hillside. If you're looking for someone to crack uh, their shields, you can use the bounty board as another way to say, hey, there's a player here. And that's what I ended up doing right there. Got the player, got a crack on their shields. And so moving on here. Now I'm gonna get a couple cracks actually right at this place here and finish off the challenge here. So that is seven of 10. And it's just like a flurry of activity. I don't know what happened at what time. I guess it was the storm bringing people inwards, but all of a sudden this just was chaos here. So here is my eight of 10 complete. Moving along, I've got my two more to go and I'm gonna get them the last two right here, just south of Reckless Railway. So this person has just opened a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle supply drop. They had a victory crown. I'll take that. They also had some pretty sweet loot. They had the mythic loot there. And so that's 9 of 10. And I'm going to get one more shot on a player as I'm just going across the river here. So anytime you're in an open area like this, always want to pay attention, looking left, right. And see at the top, see the red dots happening on the compass? That tells me that somebody's fighting. So when I'm looking for this last person to crack, I'm kind of heading for them here. And I can see them at the end of the dock here. There's players there. So I'm going to take a carefully selected shot right there, crack their shields, and the challenge is complete. Hope it's helpful. Please drop a like. Leave me a comment. If you haven't subscribed, please hit that button and show me that support. And don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad, all one word, all capital letters. Thanks for your support. Good luck with the challenge. And until the next video, this is GamerDad out.